Hello, everyone, and thank you for joining me for this day's devotion as we spend these few moments with our Good Shepherd, Jesus. Today, we're going to be using the devotion from our Martin Luther College devotional for December 3rd. It's entitled, The Mystery of Christ's Second Coming. We find the words that we want to focus on in 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verses 7 to 8. Therefore, you do not lack any spiritual gift as you eagerly wait for our Lord Jesus Christ to be revealed. He will also keep you firm to the end, so that you will be blameless on the day of our Lord Jesus Christ. Throughout history, numerous groups have predicted the second coming of Christ, only to be proven wrong when the date passed by without incident. Such predictions began early among Christians. Three theologians long ago predicted it would be 500 A.D. Currently, some are saying Jesus will return on April 8, 2024, the day of a solar eclipse scheduled to darken much of North America. We'll see. When will Jesus return? Perhaps a better question is, is this the big question of the Bible? It isn't. Jesus has already told us that no one will ever know. Sure, we can read the signs of the times and conclude it has to be soon. But then again, Christians of every age have said that. St. Paul never obs obsessed over the date of Jesus' return. Rather, Paul lived and worked as if Jesus were coming back today. And by the Holy Spirit, he encouraged both the Corinthians and us to trust in Christ and live according to God's will, eagerly looking for Jesus' return. Like Paul, we need not trouble ourselves with the mystery of Jesus' second coming. Why not? Because of another wonderful mystery, how Jesus already comes to us to make us ready to meet him. He comes quietly through the simple waters of baptism to forgive our sins and give us his Holy Spirit. He comes quietly through bread and wine to increase our faith, hope, and love. He comes by His Spirit through the, His Word, the Bible, where He teaches us to put our trust in Him. At the same time, the Spirit gives God's people spiritual gifts so we can live in a sin-sick world, serving everyone we know and meeting in genuine Christian love. In the quiet confidence of Christian faith, we know that our powerful and merciful God will keep us firm to the end so that we will be blameless on the day of our Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus is coming soon, that's for sure. But he also comes to us today to make us ready to meet him, whenever that may be. Join me in prayer. Dear Lord Jesus, your saints are waiting patiently. Come, mighty judge, and set us free from every evil. Amen. Well, my friends, keep, keep being ready. Jesus is coming soon. The date is a mystery, but the truth is there for us.